Hello and welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time Master Quest. In the last episode, we finished up the Deku Tree, the new version of the Deku Tree, and in this episode, we're leaving the Kokiri Forest. And we are immediately stopped by our good friend, Saria. Oh, you're leaving. I knew that you would leave the forest someday, Link. Because you are different from me and my friends. But that's okay, because we'll be friends forever. Won't we? I want you to have this ocarina. Please take good care of it. And then we've got our first ocarina. This is not the titular ocarina of time, but it will serve us very well. You received the fairy ocarina. This is a memento from Saria. Set it to C and use C to start playing it. On the select item subscreen, you can set it to the, the left, down, or right buttons and then use that C to start playing. You can play different notes with A and the four C buttons. Press B to quit playing or to start your song over again. When you play my ocarina, I hope you will think of me and come back to the forest to visit. Link doesn't want to say goodbye. It's a poignant little moment. The Legend of Zelda, at the very least the, uh, the 3D Zeldas, can't speak too much about the 2D Zeldas, definitely have a motif of music. You always get some sort of instrument, or something that lets you play music. Here's Hyrule Field. The big, vast expanse of the world. Another nice, fun place to run around in. But we're not doing that. <laughs> we're turning right back around and going back to that place in the Lost Woods that had those two Skull Kids there. So, yeah, right away we can see that there's more than one Skull Kid. Saria is not in here, I don't think. If she is and I've missed her, then I'm sorry, but I don't believe you can go find her now. But where's the Lost Woods? There's Lost Woods. But yeah, I'm pretty sure that it's just Mido that doesn't like us, and I think it's because he likes Saria, or maybe Saria is more powerful and he wants to be the favorite or something like that. Because he said something about like, oh, why does Saria like you? Oh, there's a Ruby back there. He said, I think he said something along the lines of like, oh, why, why are you the favorite of Saria? And he's the only one who's really mean to us, and other people have said that he's mean to them. So I suspect that Link probably doesn't have problems with most of the people in here. Although I can't imagine being different is probably not the most fun. All right, we're going this way, right? Yes, this way. Gotta love this song, by the way. This is Saria's song. This is, you know, everybody's top three songs, at least. For good reason, it's a good song. Oh, we haven't even set our ocarina to a button yet. Now that we have the Fairy Ocarina, we can do this. Follow along with our song on your ocarina. We'll lead you into it. This is basically just Simon. I am gonna be concentrating a little bit here, so I might not talk. Something good to do here is to play along with them while they're playing. Ooh. Got a nice easy pattern there. That was quite a nice session. As a token of our friendship, please take this. You got a single rupee. Do you want to play some more? Well, if we only got a single rupee, I'd say there's probably more to do. All right, here we go again. Gonna be a little harder this time. You don't have to play in rhythm, by the way. Ooh, easy pattern here, too. Just make sure if you're using a stick, like me, you don't 
like, accidentally hit the wrong button. Please don't make it hard. Keep it easy. Yep. Keeping it easy. I think we're done? Yes. Alright, what are we gonna get this time? Five rupees. It is getting better each time, so that's a hint that you should, in fact, play some more. Maybe we'll get another easy pattern here. If you if you mess up, you just can start again. Okay, has the potential to be easy or hard here. If you hear clicking and clacking, that's me playing along with them. Ooh, whoops. Oh, darn it. All right, well, let's try it again. Ugh, that was a really, really easy one, too. I pressed the wrong uh, C button there. Watch them give me a hard one now, because I messed up the easy one. <sighs> of course. Yep, now it's a hard one. C buttons mess me up a little bit because they all look they look so similar. I usually have a pretty decent memory for this kind of thing. Ah. Are we done? Nope. Okay. Ah, I forgot that last one. Ugh, I think it might have been A. Okay. All right, give me some repeats. Okay. So far, so good. And we messed it up now. <sighs> okay, not so bad. Should be one or two more. Please be done. Ah, oh, one more. All right. Oh, good. They gave me a one that matches up with that. Okay, that wasn't so bad, actually. Okay, we got through that. That was quite a nice session. As a token of our friendship, please take this. Early heart piece. You got a piece of heart. Collect four pieces total to get another heart container. More containers mean more life energy. I think that's the earliest heart piece you can get in the game, although I could be wrong about that. Because I don't... Did we get any inside the Deku Tree? We did not. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that is the first heart piece you can actually encounter in the game. Cool. <laughs> not that that's super duper important, but I, I wanted to get it because I can. And for no other reason. And also, you never see people do that early. I've watched... I haven't watched that many Let's Plays of this. I've watched a lot of the same people do Let's Plays of this, and I've watched a lot of randomizers, and I've watched a lot of speedruns. 
But I mean, then those are all kind of categories that would not encourage that sort of uh, sequence break. But I've never seen anybody do that before, so that doesn't mean they haven't. But I haven't seen it. So there you go. <laughs> Let's head out into Hyrule Field now. We're going to hurry our way over to the castle. One complaint I do have about this game is the day-night cycle is way too short. And I guess the idea is... Oh, this guy's here. Hoot hoot! Link, look up here. It appears that the time has finally come for you to start your adventure. You will encounter many hardships ahead. That is your fate. Don't feel discouraged, even during the toughest times. Go straight this way and you will see Hyrule Castle. You will meet a princess there. If you are lost and don't know which way to go, look at the map. The areas you have explored will be shown on the map. Press start to enter the subscreens and L or R to find the map. On the map subscreen, you will also see a flashing dot showing you which way you should go next. Did you get all that? Now here's where you gotta be careful. If you were pressing B to, uh, or even A, to try to scroll through that text as quickly as possible, it starts you on the no. So make sure you go down to yes. All right then, I'll see you around. Hoot 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 ho. <laughs> That's Kipora Gabora. I'm not sure he ever actually introduces himself. I, I like him. <laughs> He's fun. What was I saying? Yes, the day-night cycle is very, very short, and I get that they try to do that in case you're, like, stuck at a time where it's not supposed to be. You don't have to wait all that long. But it ends up meaning that if you have to do something, either during the day or at night, you have a very short time limit to actually do it. And as much as I'd like to go to Lon Lon Ranch first before the castle, just because I like sequence breaking for whatever reason, I'm going to try to make a beeline for the castle. It's not looking good. I think we let a little bit too much time go by because time passed when we had to turn back into the woods. Oh, come on, come on. Oh, we made it. That was really close. We will get something to deal with the day-night cycle later, but we don't have it now. Welcome to Hyrule Castle Town. It's a peaceful, prosperous town. If we go in here, there's a room where you can grind lots and lots of rupees, which we don't actually really need right now, although we could use a couple. There's stuff in the boxes, too. In particular, there's something in one of the boxes, and I don't remember which one it is. Oh, come on. Come on, now. Not there. Not there. Guess it must be one of these. This one? It's a little finicky to get these to break. Nope, must be this one. There we go, we get a gold sc Of course I let it touch me. Gold Sculptula. That's, I wanna say token number three? That's all we really need from here right now. Man, I am so bored. Things would sure be more interesting if there were more troubles in the world. Hey, that's just between you and me, okay? Anyway, maybe we can let off some steam by breaking these jars. Stand near a jar and press A to lift it. Press A again to toss it. Or you can just, you know, break it with your sword. I don't think there's anything in here that we need besides money, which we have enough of. Maybe I'll get some on the way out. I think the stuff will respawn, but it's just not worth taking the time, because once you have 99 rupees, you can't collect anymore. There is plenty to do in Castle Town, some of which can only be done during the day, and some of which can only be done at night. Huff, huff. I'm late. I'm late for a very important date. I don't... I think that guy's important in this game. He is in Majora's Mask. <clears throat> this beard is my pride and joy. Doesn't it look luxuriant, kid? I guess. It's a little hard to see from far away. Can I break this? Yes, there's nothing in it. There's no reason to do that. This is, I want to say, the slingshot. No, this is the shop. Okay. I heard a rumor that there is a monster that eats Hylian shield somewhere out there in the world. Have you ever seen it? No, but he is right. It does exist. Talk, talk to me. Welcome. We don't need any of this stuff. What I'm interested in is the Hylian shield for 80 rupees. We don't need it yet, but we will need... Oh, shoot. I just realized you can actually get one of those for free coming up pretty soon. Oops. <laughs> oh, well. 
Link, if young Link actually can use the Hylian Shield, it's just ineffective. It's effective for some things. It's too big for us right now, so we just sort of do a duck. That will be useful in an area coming up, which is why I wanted to get it now. Although, like I said, I remembered as I was buying it that you can actually get one for free very easily coming up very soon. Well, let's go grind for some money. <laughs> There's a way to do this outside the castle as well, but it's about to become nighttime, so let's not. There is stuff in the marketplace that we're going to want to spend money on. Quite a bit of stuff, in fact. Let's uh, let's just fill up. Well, I don't know if we're going to fill up, but let's get as close to full as we can. And I'm pretty sure we can do this whenever we want. I guess they were nice. They knew that there's a lot of stuff in Hyrule, uh, Hyrule Castle Town that costs money, so you would want to have a lot of it close by. Although this is not really enough. I think what we're gonna do is... Gosh, I really wish I hadn't bought that shield. I think we're gonna continue on the main quest and then come back and do some of the money stuff later. Because I want to be able to get the, um, the, the rupees outside Castletown. But if it's gonna be nighttime, then that's not really gonna be all that helpful. Can I talk to anybody back there? No, it doesn't look like it. I think a very major strength of this game is these small areas like this. They really feel alive and full of stuff and people. I wanted to see Princess Zelda. I avoided the guards, swam through the moat. I was almost there when they caught me. I found a small drain hole on the right side of the castle that I thought I could sneak into, but I got stuck there. <laughs> That's a hint. <laughs> what a crazy guy. Can you believe this guy was crazy enough to try to sneak into the castle to see Princess Zelda? All because of this idiot. They've tightened security at the castle. <laughs> well, that is too bad for us. I want to talk to everybody I can in here. Do you know about the Temple of Time that we have in the northeast part of town? Legends say that the Temple of Time is the entrance to the Sacred Realm. Did you know that? Well, we'll probably find out if legends are true. Have you heard the legend of, sha of the Shadow Folk? They are the Sheikah, the shadows of the Hylians. They say they swore allegiance to the King of Hyrule and guarded the royal family. But with the long peace, no one has seen a Sheikah around here for a long time. However, I heard there is one Sheikah woman living in the castle. There usually is. <laughs> That's another recurring thing in Zelda. I made a lot of money. Maybe I should go look for more things to sell. I know. I should go to Lake Hylia. Many things float down the river and end up there. <laughs> hey, get what money you can. I'm not dancing, you know. My back itches. Ooh, ah, ooh. Hey, forest boy. This is the city of Hyrule. Take your time and enjoy the sights. If you came here to see Hyrule Castle, take the street on your right. If you want to see the back alleys of the town, take the street to the left. There are things to do in the back alleys. Can I talk to this little girl? Just chasing a, a cuckoo around. Can I pick that guy up? Ah, well, we'll get that later. Hey, your clothes. They're different. You're not from around here, are you? Oh, you're a fairy boy from the forest. My name is Malin. My dad owns Lon Lon Ranch. Dad went to the castle to deliver some milk, and he hasn't come back yet. We've been getting some hints about stuff happening at the castle. My precious puppy can run faster than any of the other mutts around here. Um, I don't know about that. Kid, have you been to Lon Lon Ranch? Their milk is delicious. There are many horses there, and the young daughter of the ranch owner is cute. To get to Lon Lon Ranch, after you leave town, head due south across the field. You should visit the ranch at least once. We will be visiting there more than once. Oh, you are so handsome. Just like the King of Hyrule. <laughs> Can I talk to, to the other one? No, I guess not. Oh no, he did reply, shoot. 
Yeah, they just, they go back and forth. Okay. Oh, you are more beautiful than Princess Zelda. Oh, well, it's nice to see people happy. That was the bazaar. This is the potion shop. We can't actually do anything in there right now because you need to have a bottle, but I'll show, show what they have in here. There's a rumor going around that there's a potion shop that can make the ultimate medicine. We won't be seeing that place for a long time. Welcome. Let's just see what they have in here. The usual Deku nuts. We've got a Poe. There's no reason to buy that. A fish. No reason to buy that either. Bottle bug. No reason to buy that. We can find those easily. Blue fire. Definitely no reason to buy that. That doesn't do anything except in a couple of very specific places. A fairy spirit. I think that just means it's a fairy. We'll talk about fairies later. Red potion recovers all your life energy, and green potion recovers your magic, which we don't even have yet. But like I said, we need a bottle to, c to carry any of those items. I don't think I've ever actually bought anything from that shop. Most of that stuff is stuff you can either find elsewhere or find alternatives to elsewhere. The Happy Mask Shop. Yes, it started in this game, not Ocarina of Time. Happy Mask Shop. Please read this sign before you use this shop. How this shop works. We do not sell masks at this shop. We just lend them to you. You sell the loaned masks on your own. You pay back the money for, a ma for the mask and we will lend you a newer model. You can borrow masks you have already sold again. However, you can sell each model of mask only once. Please try our shop. A very strange business model. What a strange shop. I wonder when it'll be open for business. I read the sign there, but it still seems weird. Yeah, it is definitely weird. Oh, just talking to that guy again. But yeah, there's nothing to do here yet. There will be later. This shop is not ever really going to be that important. But, well, it's a thing to do, so we will be doing it. This is the Temple of Time. Nothing for us to do here now. But I figure we can come and take a look at it. It is part of making Hyrule Castle Town what it is. You can see there's an empty stone plinth there. I like this music a lot. It's not like a song I would listen to, but it's very nice for what it's supposed to be. There are three hollows and an inscription here. Ye who owns three spiritual stones, stand with the Ocarina of Time and play the Song of Time. That is how the inscription reads. There, there's a way to, like, glitch your way past this door here. I have no idea how to do it, and I wouldn't do it anyway. I like sequence breaking, but I'm here to show off the game, not skip half of it. But, yeah, that's the Temple of Time. Very solitary, somber, holy feeling kind of place. Which is exactly what they were going for. More of those stones there. I don't think those stones ever become super important. But we will be able to interact with them later. Uh, I think I'm thinking I'm in the wrong area. There are some games to play here. Although this one... Well, this one's closed until nighttime, I think. Treasure chest contest temporary closed open tonight. Yeah, you can only get into that one at night. That's also not something we're going to be doing right now. We need another item for that. Or... <laughs> You really should have another item for that. It's not impossible without it, but it's not worth it. This is the Bomchi Bowling Alley. I, don't, I think it costs 40 rupees to play. Let's find out. Oh, I'm sorry. We're not open for business yet. Please come back soon. Oh. I wonder when this opens. I'm guessing the Slingshot game's not open either, then. I guess maybe you have to have seen Zelda first. Please, with C, please sell me something. Please, with C. I think that's just something to do if you need extra money. I'm fairly certain you don't have to do anything with that character. Although, again, I could be wrong. The shooting gallery, I'm guessing you're not open either. Oh, no, you can, okay. Do you want to play a game? It's 20 rupees per play. Yes, I do want to play a game. This is a game for grown-ups. Hyrule's famous shooting gallery. Take aim at the targets from that platform over there. Can you hit 10 targets? You get 15 shots. Draw your weapon with B. Are you ready? Go for a perfect score. Good luck. I'm not that good at this game. Gonna do the best I can. This is probably gonna take multiple tries. I am almost certain I'm probably gonna have to cut at least once. Yeah, we already lost. I am 
not gonna make you sit here and watch me do this for however many tries it takes. Ugh. Yeah, I'm gonna show you once, and then eventually when I come back to it, which isn't gonna be right now, because I don't have the money for it. Too bad. Practice hard and come back. Do you want to play again? No, I don't have I don't have the money for that right now. This is gonna be something that I do off screen, and then I'll just show you my successful attempt. I am not very good at that game. It's not that hard. It's actually very easy. But I'm so used to the aiming on Wind Waker that I have trouble acclimating to the aiming on the uh, Ocarina of Time. Hey, what? What's wrong with loitering around all day? Huh, kid? Um, well, depends on what you want out of life. Strange, this door doesn't open. That, I want to say, is the bomb chew shop, but I guess it makes sense they wouldn't let you get in there yet. It seems strange that packs of dogs roam our streets at night. Doesn't that seem weird to you? Yeah, remember what he said there. Packs of dogs do roam the streets at night. Um, camera's not cooperative back here. Hey, Sonny, I'll tell you something helpful. I heard there's a mysterious fountain somewhere near the castle. There is, but we can't get there yet. I'm guessing the bomb shop won't open until we get the bomb bag, which again, makes sense. Uh, oh, that's right, I was gonna say there's supposed to be a woman in here. She's out in the square right now. She'll be in there at night. And then... Strange, this door doesn't open. Hmm. We'll have to try those again when it's nighttime, I guess. Well, we've done all we can here for now. So, let's head to the castle. I'm actually... No, I think you can do it now. I was gonna say, I don't think the character we need is gonna be here until night. I actually don't think that's the trigger. I think you need to get caught by the guards and then she'll show up. Because you can get all the way over to the castle. <laughs> Hey, Link, this way! <laughs> Head's upside down now. The princess is inside the castle just ahead. Be careful not to get caught by the guards. <laughs> oh, this ground. Oh, on this ground, time flows normally. But time stands still while you are in Lon Lon Ranch or in a town. If you want time to pass normally, you'll need to leave town. Well, well, which way are you going to go now? <laughs> Do you want to hear what I said again? No. No, I don't need to. Ooh, you're a smart kid. Good luck, then. Woohoo! Once it officially turns into night, I am going to turn back and go to Castletown at night. I think it's safe to say that it is now nighttime. There is a spider in here. Let's try not to get hit this time. Got another gold sculpture token. Is there anything here? No, guess not. I want to say the gold sculptulas have... S oh, yeah, there's bugs. Have some sort of interaction with bugs, like the bugs kill it, or they it kills the bugs, or something like that. The great Deku Tree wanted us to go visit the princess at Hyrule Castle. Shouldn't we get going? Yeah, we're going to get caught first, and then I'll turn back. Because I'm pretty sure you have to get caught. Like I, like I was saying, you can go all the way up to Hyrule Castle, and you won't be able to do what you need to do. Welcome to Hyrule Castle Town. It's a peaceful, prosperous town. Can I not get caught? Do I have to climb the thing? Hmm, I don't remember what the exact trigger is for this. I'm gonna try going back into town and coming back out. We need uh, Malin to be out here, and she's gonna give us something. Well, since we're here, we can do something. Kids shouldn't be wandering around town at nighttime. Stay indoors until morning. There are indeed packs of, uh, packs of wild dogs. Kitchen, oh, that's the same thing the other guy said. Boring. We need, I want to, is it this dog? We need a white dog. I don't know if it's this white dog. If you get close to a dog, it will follow you, which is the cutest thing ever. And you need a particular dog to be following you. Because, as it turns out... This woman is looking for a dog. Ah, that's not my dog. How could you mix up my puppy with a mutt like that? That is not the correct dog. Okay. I can't find my puppy anywhere. I need you to look for it, please. I thought for sure that was going to be it. I guess there's another white dog. The problem is, if you get a dog following you, you can't have another one follow you. 
Okay, yeah, this these doors open at night. Ah, uh, this is the bomb shop, but it's not open yet. Because they don't want you having bombs yet. <laughs> Makes sense. Oh, that's right. This is, this is the dog. Oh, but now I've got a brown dog following me. Oh, no, he just stopped. All right, come this way. Come this way, puppy. I think you're supposed to know that you need a white dog because she had a white dog running around her earlier. Here we are. No, that's still not the right dog. Huh. This poor cute little puppy. Let's take a look at that last, uh, that last door that wouldn't open. And then I think we'll be done for this episode. Oh, now we've got a little brown one following us. I thought her dog was white. Maybe if, maybe I'm wrong. Can we go in here? Oh, the puppy follows us. Oh, look how cute. They're little Scotty dogs. It seems strange that, oh, you say the same thing. Oh man, they make a strange, mysterious door and then there's nothing in it? Boring. Well, either way, we'll continue explore. Oh, he's still following us. It's too cute. We'll continue looking for the right dog next time. Thank you very much for watching this episode of Let's Play o uh, Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time Master Quest. And hopefully I'll see you in the next episode where we find the right dog. And of course, go to see Princess Zelda. Bye-bye!